Hunter Biden uh, indicted nine counts of tax evasion by, you know, a Justice Department under a Democratic president. Not only that, a Democratic president who happens to be his father. Uh, do you think if it were you or me, we would have been indicted for these same crimes? Oh, we would have been indicted for much more. Uh, so you, you don't think his name has hurt him in this case? I think Hunter Biden's name has helped him greatly in this case. But, I mean, now he's, you know, been, you know, indicted on these, on these counts, not to mention gun charges. You do the crime, you do the time. Lack of awareness with these Trump supporters is beyond laughable. The idea that we're sitting here talking about Hunter Biden being charged by a democratically controlled administration, which happens to be his father's DOJ, but the same department and when it was on the Donald Trump's administration, the Department of Justice, Bill Barr, refused to bring charges against Hunter Biden. This was not a democratically controlled administration. It was Donald Trump, the very paraphernalia that these people are wearing, MAGA material on all of these people re regurgitating some of the dumbest ish we've ever heard as it pertains to lives. He's corrupt. I think, uh, I don't. I, you think I, Biden's corrupt? I know he is. Are you kidding? He sold our country out to China, which is without a doubt. And, and if you don't know it now, or I'm sorry, if you don't know it now, everybody's going to find out about it. That's what these all these uh, hearings are about and everything else. Yeah. As it pertains to logic, logic is the magic word. It's what's missing from the entire Trump camp. People sitting on cameras saying that Hunter Biden is being privileged because his name is Biden, even though it was, even though it was Biden's DOJ that charged him. Anybody else, like Donald Trump's DOJ, wouldn't even have brought charges against Hunter Biden. And the fact, though, beyond that, the fact that Republicans can say if you do the crime, you do the time. When it pertains to Hunter Biden, lets me know that they have a sense of justice in their mind. But if they have that sense of justice in their mind, where does that, when it applies to Donald Trump? Do you think that, um, now that we're on to that and his family, Hunter Biden was just indicted, nine indictments against him for tax fraud. Do you think if his last name wasn't Biden that he would have had those indictments? Oh, hell no. You know why? Because first of all, Joe and Jill Biden set their son up, a druggie, who got kicked out of the military, couldn't do one thing right in his life, and all of a sudden he's the freaking executive of Burisma. Uh, they set their son up for corruption because they were pulling the strings behind the thing. I feel very sorry. I feel sorry for Jill that she knows her husband's got dementia and she still parades him around. And my wife and I laugh about it. There's no way if I had dementia like that, that my wife would let me out because she loves me. How is this pick and choose thing possible? It must be something different. And it's this Donald Trump scratched the itch of whiteness for them. The idea that they are superior and their blood can be poisoned by others. Their country can be stolen by others. They're losing their country, the way things used to be, to others. This is the, this is the whole nostalgic idea of Trump. Make America great again. Please tell me when America was great, if you weren't a white person. If you want a white person, America is as truer to as many people now to being equitable than it has ever been in history. So why is this large swath of Americans, overwhelmingly white Americans, yearning for a time where women had less right, where black men had less right, black women had less rights, Latinx people had let's rights because the entire MAGA movement, it's not about any political platform outside of the ideology of whiteness, which is why banning books are so important. Hunter Biden, nine counts of tax evasion on top of two indictments for uh, illegally possessing a firearm. Do you think that any uh, of that would happen to him if his last name wasn't Biden? 
I, you know, I, what I do know is I know he left a trail in the White House of some, some white powder. That's what I do know. Do you think that was uh, when they found the Secret Service found that it was? Oh, I, know, I, I know it's him. Think about what I'm saying. This is not a leftist idea. These are facts. This is what's happening with that party. It has lost the platform. It has given up on his platform and settled tightly in the idea that Donald Trump is above the law, which in itself is anti-American, which in itself makes you impossible to be a patriot. You cannot be anti-Constitution. You cannot be praising the idea that you're going to be a dictator for one day. A dictator for one day is anti-American every day. And so is Donald Trump and his minions who believe that Hunter Biden is getting special privilege while Donald Trump is berating people, court systems in this country that are trying him for crimes that he committed. Mr. Trump, why did you watch this? election interference. They made up a fake case. They're fraudulent people. And the judge already knows what he's going to do. He's a Democrat judge. In all fairness to him, he has no choice. He has no choice. He's run by the Democrats. I know this city better than anybody knows this city. There's nobody knows it like I do. And they don't have a problem with it. All their religious philosophy goes out the window when Trump is considered a rapist by a court. When Trump says you can grab him by the, you know what, on tape. When Trump steals American documents, when Donald Trump praises dictators around the world in Vladimir Putin and Kim Jong-un, strong men, he liked them. When he, when he praised the idea of doing away with the Constitution or preventing the peaceful transfer of power, which this country has done forever before him. But Republicans don't care because he scratches the itch for them. What's your itch? Will it cause you to be anti-American as well? I'm Mundell Robinson. Don't be dumb.